Hi, I'm Scorpion, and this fluff ball thing that squeaks uh, is Puff and Stuff. Well, Puff. Um, I don't, I don't have any affiliation with Tito Marty Croft. I don't make money off of him. Please don't sue me. Anyway, <laughs> um, I just wanted to make a little announcement uh, about Anthrocon that's coming up this week. <laughs> Anyway, um, I'm going to be wearing this fluff ball, which is ironic, because this head, uh, before it was actually refer before it was refurbished into something I could actually wear and that didn't suffocate me. Yes, the, how it used to be suffocated me. You had, it was about this much airflow. This much. You could fit, like, maybe a... Maybe a straw if you were lucky in there. Um, so yeah, now I can open his mouth up and he's actually uh, very comfortable. Anyhow, uh, also another thing that I fixed was um, he used to be so heavily padded and I couldn't hear anything. It was all muffled. Uh, I kind of reduced that by uh, the mouth lines. So yeah, that's fun. Anyway, um, I'm gonna be at Anth I'm gonna be at Anthrocon Thursday, late Thursday, uh, until uh Sunday. Uh, Monday I'm leaving, but uh, I like to just say the whole convention, whatever. Um, now I am going to be buying a first suit off of somebody, and I am not going to reveal anything until I get him. Um. But, uh, I believe her brand name is Wild vs. Kings. I think that's it. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure that's it. I'm almost positive. Anyway, um, I just wanted to give a little heads up, though. Um, I will be full suiting in the most mixed match suit you will ever see, ever. The reason why is because I want good ventilation and I want to wear a full suit that I have been working on for a while, which I actually realized after I modified my Digi bodysuit, I had to fix the legs again. I had to actually, I was so pissed because it, I don't have a duct tape dummy and then I had to modify and I'm low on sparkle fur and I had to do this and that and this and that and this and that. So I just took the lazy way and I just sewed the fur the lazy way. I'm not going to say anything other than that. Um. With this head, I has this much vision. Um, also, as you can see, the green is actually really thickly painted on. So that also uh, messes up my vision. So I can't see very well in him. Uh, I can see mostly out the white patches. But, I mean, I, can, I can't see well. Um, so I will be wearing a my black... Uh, so itchy. My black digi bodysuit. Um, with my long floor dragger tail that I just did a video on. Um, this head, I will be buying a head, or buying a partial, my bad. But I'm probably just going to be wearing the head and I'm going to wear my long dragger tail. Um, I'm probably not even going to wear, uh the suit as a part or mini partial it's just paws feet or paws hand or, i can't speak today paws ahead and the tail and um my fuck i hate i hate yeah um but anyhow i am going to be there the full four days this year unlike last year where i had to go home um on Saturday night, because Sunday I worked in the morning, which I almost died. I was so tired, and uh, I didn't. We didn't have the hotel for the extra night, which is uh, depressing. So, anyway, come find me. Come say hi. I I don't bite. I actually do bite. Don't tell anybody. Um. Also, I just want to make it clear: if you try grabbing my suit. Or if you try pulling on my tail, especially pulling on my tail, I am deheading 
And I am personally going to get secure. I am going to look at your badge and I'm going to tell security. I'm not dealing with that. Again. People think it's cute. I think it's just being stupid. Um, honestly, I'm going to sound really rude. But you have to be pretty brain dead to grab somebody's uh, fursuit and try to rip their tail. Yeah, last year I had people who were trying to, like, shred my tail. As you can see, this giant blue thing. Uh, it's all double stitched. And the top of it has this fleece belt sewn on that I made. Because it carries the weight much nicer than a belt does. And uh, somebody, somebody ripped the belt clean off. So that was fun. I wanted to kill them. I had no idea. And then I had people trying to actually grab the fur and pull it off. And, oh, it's not cute. It's really not cute. That's like if I went up to somebody with a pair of scissors and tried cutting their fur on their fursuit. That's like if somebody had a fursuit that didn't have a perfect shave job. And I was like, I'm going to cut your fursuit and make it look good. Don't do that. Also, I fixed his booper. Uh, now there's not that horrible glue blob in there um please don't boot me i am begging you somebody almost broke my nose last year because they kept hitting me with an inflatable baseball bat you know who you are you know fucking damn well who you are i don't remember their name but i was so pissed off just don't like <sighs> if you want to boop gently uh ask permission don't just come up to me and be like, BOOP! BOOP! It's so cute! Because, uh, the thing is, whenever I wear my head, my glass, he sits about here. You'll be actually, you, you see these glasses? I actually have metal frames again. You see, you see, I can't see for shit right now. You see where, you see these little metal prongs? With these little, uh, plastic bits. Those will dig into my fucking nose if you push on it. I will dumb it down. The metal parts on the glasses that I see out of, you push, they dig in. I bleed. You pay for that. Um, because some people actually don't understand what it means to have personal space and keep your hands to yourself. Because some people think, I'm going to touch all the fursuiters. Well, I'm sorry to break the magic, honey, but there are people in all those costumes. Um, you risk hurting people if you're not gentle. You need to ask permission. Don't touch tails. I don't give a fuck. Don't touch anyone's tail. I don't care if... You think that it's appropriate or what? The only time I could see it's appropriate if somebody is going to go down the elevator or down the escalator and they have a floor dragger and you think, oh no, they're not holding it. Give them a light tap and say, hey, I, your, your tail. And, um, or you could even be nice and tell them and then say, hey, if you want, if you can't reach it, I can hand it to you, and you can just hold it and carry it down. Which, I mean, I would <laughs> I would love if people did that. But, of course, we always have people trying to just grab and grab and grab it so long! I think my tail is about six feet this year. It's shorter than last year. That big blue thing, that's about eight feet. Yeah! Don't touch it! And I'm gonna have a tail cover on, so hopefully it'll uh, keep people from trying to... Rip my tail apart because that fur was not cheap. Joanne's is not cheap. Um, but I will be having three suits with me. I'm going to have puffin stuff. I'm going to have a secret suit. And then I'm going to have Ember. Um, which, uh, my secret suit is just personal. It, it's a personal thing and I don't feel like... That's just me enjoying the convention, really, and not really filming much. <laughs> um... But my suit that I am buying, um, I'm not going to reveal anything until I actually buy him just because I feel like that's a, that's appropriate, more appropriate than being like, hey, I'm buying this suit. And then it's like later on, it's like, oh, wait, no, I'm not. But uh, I am. I just have to, <laughs> I have to wait until Friday. Um, 
I think that's all. So, if you want to find me, just look for this thing that squeaks. And, um, I will be giving out fursuit badges to people that I drew for them. Um, no, I will not draw badges on request. Uh, it's more like, it's more for people that are my friends and also people that I watch on YouTube. But, like I said, I don't. If, if you ask me to make you one, I won't do it because I feel like you should be paying me. If you're going to come up and ask me, I feel like it's only fair that I get paid for it. But art is easy. Then do it yourself. Jeez. If art is so easy, do it yourself. Seriously, if anyone ever asks for f fucking free art, tell them to do it themselves if, the, if it's that easy. Um... What else? Um, also, I will be trying to suit the entire con, but um, I am going to be live streaming most of the convention, but like I've said a thousand times, it's only going to be like 10 to 30 minutes at most, because at a time, because my phone cannot handle that. My phone and live feed, it does, it overheats very badly. Hence why on my live streams, I can only go an hour, and my phone does not like that. Um, also, it is going to be 90 degrees at Anthrocon, so everyone who is going, stay hydrated. And my recommendation is use water bottles because the water at anthrocon is ice cold and the last thing you want is your body to go in shock i can tell you personally it's not fun you will almost you will probably throw up and if you're drinking through your head and you're like chugging water or whatever you will vomit in that head don't think i'm kidding you i've had it almost happen twice actually it was like two years in a row um, but, also, I'm going to be carrying a, uh, stuffed animal around. Please don't touch it. Please don't try and grab it and be like, Hi, hey, look, 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 I've heard horror stories of people who do that. Don't do that. I will, I will fucking, I will get fucking pissed off and I will get security. I don't care if it's a joke. I don't care if you're like, eh, you're in Tattletown. Well, you know what? You shouldn't grab other people's property and be a retard. I don't like that word, but I'm just saying. You don't want to be fucking stupid. Um. Anyhow. If you want to photograph with me at Anthrocon, um. The, I, I, I want to... I would really appreciate if I'm on that social media platform that you could tag me. Um, just so I can see said photo, because some photos have gone into the abyss of where the fuck have they gone. Also, tip of advice, if anyone in business comes up to you and asks, hey, can I take your photo for my company or whatever? Walk. Just keep walking. Ignore them. Take your head off and just walk. Don't go near them. Because I, some fucking business cunt wads took my photos and... With their mascots in front of me, and I have no idea what happened. And honestly, if somebody tried to come up to me and say, Ah, uh, well, you let them. I had, I had my vision in my older head. It was tunnel vision. It was looking through a tube. And, um, even then, I, I, I had, like, this much vision. I had almost worse than tear duct. Anyway, uh, enough of my rambling. I will see you guys Thursday through Sunday. Well, technically it's through Monday, but the convention is only until Sunday. Um, also, just a little heads up, I am going to be um, live streaming for sure the uh, parade and the Angel Dragon meetup. So, if anyone is interested in, like, watching those things. Like, those are what I know I'm gonna record. Um, just... Excuse me.
just uh, keep wa keep mm, watch out on my watch my <gasps> just keep an eye on my channel. Um, I'm not going to be uploading very much until Anthrocon, just because I have uh, work to be done. So yeah. Anyway, bye.